Hey, good morning. This is Tommy. And this is Lori. We're at the Amaclola State Park today. Uh, this is just where they uh, the, all the hikers check in. And uh, there's a, a really nice little visitor center. Shows uh, state snakes and um, turtles. And you can get t-shirts and all kinds of different things. And as you can tell, we're not hikers. They are. <laughs> we're just here uh, taking a look. We had uh, a couple of inches of snow last night. So you're just riding around, see what to see. So and they got a uh, nice uh, waterfall we're going to go take a look at here in just a minute. So we will see you there. This is a mile and a half. And 600 horses. Okay. Yeah. Well, I mean, we're, we'll do that. We're going to do whatever we can do safely for them. They just got a little king snake. That's what that one was. Milk snake. Milk snake. Non venomous. Bottom of the falls. Uh, can't really see a whole lot from here, but we're gonna go up and uh, have a little closer look. During the summertime, you could actually fish over here and do some trout fishing. So I mean, it's a nice little place to take the kids. There's some um, pavilions. There's cabin rentals and stuff. Yeah, like I said, it snowed last night, and you still got quite a few people that are just coming up here taking a look. It's a real nice place in the winter time. So we're gonna get a little closer up that way. That's the falls. You can you can actually see the top. Top of the falls, uh, I think it's like a thousand foot up, and you can actually walk this trail all the way to the top, which is a bunch of steps. <laughs> and you cross over the falls, I think three times on the way up. So you got a lot of great places to get some pictures and video. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't bring my drone today because it was windy, and I forgot it. <laughs> you forgot. But. Uh, we're gonna go up to the top here in a little bit, but you can We're can't, not walking. Yeah, we're not walking this trail. We're gonna drive up to the top. I, I've done it about five years ago. Uh, it's pretty intense, but if you take your time, it's not that bad. Yeah, there's a sign up that tells you how many steps it is to the top, and it's a lot. So uh, we will see y'all at the top. Oh yeah, and we probably forgot to mention that there are rentals. Uh, you can rent cabins, which you can see the cabins. This is at the lower base. There's a lodge at the top. We'll take a look at that when we go up. Um, they have they have cabins at the top. It's all uh, secluded. You're not on top of each other. These are a little close. I think there's only five or six down here. But um, you're right here at the falls. You can hear the water running. And uh, 
we don't know how much they are or not. We'll find that out and put well, it. Well, no, a long time ago, I checked into it because we were gonna actually rent something, and it fell through. But I think they were like about 150 a night. I think which, yeah, I mean, if you factor in what a hotel room's gonna cost, but they also have pavilions and stuff out here too so you can do family events you know reunions whatever yeah, weddings yeah. Picnic they do weddings. tables uh, some grills set up out here so nice playground for kids yeah so you know you could spend a whole day here uh having having family or just coming up having a picnic or whatever you like to do we'll go on up the falls and we'll show you the lodge too all right So we're at the lodge now. This is the view right off the back side of the lodge. We noticed going in there was some gift shops and there is a, uh, a restaurant in there. So we might uh, check out the gift shop, maybe the restaurant, we'll see. See what all they have. But this is the view. And you have right here is the rooms. So the rooms you know, not all of them, but these rooms have this amazing view of the North Georgia mountains. Uh, we'll see if we can find out how much it costs to stay here. I bet it's not cheap, but we'll take a look. All right, we're back outside the lodge. It place is beautiful. It is really nice, set up really nice. It does have a restaurant in it little expensive but you know for what it is it's fine we did check on the room rates for you so it's a uh, 129 during the week and then a uh, like 149 during the weekend people from Tennessee and Florida they get a 20% discount and then all veterans get 25% off yep so it's a really nice place to stay it's got great views um, they're really really friendly in there yeah, so super friendly the price ain't bad for for where you're at so uh, Check it out. One more thing, I forgot to mention this. Um, it's not just staying at a lodge in the mountains. They actually have zip lining. So here in the parking lot, you can see it starts. I don't think it starts there. I think it's just a platform, but. You see platforms yeah. here. And it comes through the trees. Another platform. It goes on out through the woods. We didn't check on the price on that because we wasn't aware that they had it. So uh, they do have zip lining. I'll look that up and post it on the screen for y'all. As always, guys, thanks for going along with us. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and hit that bell to get notifications for new videos. See you next time.